Brooklyn man is dead after being punched during a fight. Now police are looking for the suspect who threw that fatal blow. CBS 2's Andrea Klein Thomas has more from Brighton Beach. Police say the surveillance video taken after the attack shows the shirtless suspect. Investigators also want to talk to the woman he's with. Authorities believe this man threw the punch that killed Dimitri Goldfarb on the Brighton Beach boardwalk. It's very busy here at 545 in the evening and there are a lot of people around. There's, you know, And it's still sun, you know, the sun's out. Police were called to Regalman Boardwalk East in Brighton 6th Street around 545 in the evening on July 9th. There, they found the 52-year-old with head trauma. Goldfarb died the next day at the hospital. But before he did, officers were able to speak to him. Police say Goldfarb and the suspect did not know each other, and investigators are still trying to determine the circumstances that led up to this brutal attack. I'm upset because he, he, he's human. He's a he's, he's person. But life is life. I'm, I'm so sorry about him. Andre Simono is the superintendent in Goldfarb's apartment building. He described Goldfarb as having a large stature and is surprised that a punch could kill him. He died? Yeah, he died. When? He died? It's true? It's true. Big guys, yeah? Neighbors were shot too. Now, days later, they didn't even know Goldfarb was dead. They say the victim often kept to himself. I'm here like over 70 years, and it's very rare that you have a murder. You know, you have people fight, but this, this is like ridiculous. But this fight turned deadly. In Brighton Beach, Andrea Klein Thomas, CBS 2 News.